Over here, you find uh, this is the next of my inventions. Uh, I've invented and registered. Uh, this, can you see this on the left? That's, that's the Nana Peak. It's named after my late wife. And uh, the, in the circle, it put I and the shape of the heart. I love Nana. I love my wife. So that's um, a memorial to her. And I have invented this peak. I've already done the registration for Australia, for Hong Kong, uh, China, uh, European Community, and the United States is pending. On the right here is the normal peak that you find in the stores, which is the normal shaped peak, as you can see. Now, I've invented a, the new peak with a, a double point, like this, as you can see, because I. Uh, it uh, it came it came out by accident because when I first played the the mandolin, I used a normal pick, and because I was new, I I was nervous and I sweated a lot, and the, the pick fell off my hand through sweating. So I tried to drill a hole through it, and so I can put through a string and tie it to my finger, and I cracked it when I drilled it. So when the crack came up. A thought came to me that I should use that crack part and see the sound, and uh, it gave a strange sound, so that's how it started. And then finally, I deliberately made it to shape like that after a lot of experiments. I've been working on this peak for the last 12, 12 years, and so now, as so. So you can hear a single sound now. When, I'm, when I apply the, the two sides of the peak, I, st I start with, with one side first, you can hear a single sound, and as I tilt the peak so that the, the, the strings come at a slant, like so, when, when I hold the peak in, uh, at right angles to the string, it produces a single sound. Now, as I play the, the strings, as I strike the strings, I gradually turn the pick on, a, on the side, like so, on a slant. And so, you see, it, it produces a double sound. Then when I turn it back, single sound again, and I gradually turn it. So, you have the double sound. Single sound, double sound. And when I strike the two, two strings together, you like it's the sound of a foxtrot, like a horse on a on a on a on a, uh, a trot, or what do you call the horse when it uh, canter on a canter. When the horse is on a cant on a canter, like so. So when I when I have a that's a single sound again. So when I tilt it on an angle, it becomes a double sound. So you, you can change the, the sound from a single to a double whilst you're playing the piece of uh, music all at the one time. And so you can have a, a multiple sound like this. the single sound, you have the double sound, you have the multiple sound, so 
you have the strum. So you can strum, you have a strumming sound, you have a multiple sound, you have a double sound, and you have a single sound using the one peak during the course of the one music, for example. Sometimes I have a saw, like you're sawing a piece of timber. And sometimes I have a circular action like this. It's like a circle. I circle it a bit, like a circling action, or a saw action, or like a saw. See the way uh, my, my fingers are moving? It's like a saw, like you saw a piece of timber, not, not too much, not exaggerated, but just slightly, so that you can produce the double effect, double sound effect. Then you have the single sound, and then change, So you can vary the sound as you play the piece of instrument, the music, I mean, so that uh, you have a variety of uh, sound output, single sound, you can go back and forth to a double sound, a multiple sound, and you strum it a little bit so that uh, you're just the one player, but you're sounding as though there are two players or three players playing together in, in a, like a duet or trio, and yet it's really just one player all by yourself. So the effect of this peak is, is different from the normal, and yet, the, as the shape, as you can see the shape, you can still use it like in the normal way, uh, with the addition of this uh, little bit here. So that uh, this peak is versatile, and uh, it can produce all those different sounds, and I think this is an, uh, 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 something new to the manner of picking styles that has been go going on for centuries and centuries. And this, uh, and an introduction here, I believe, if it can be uh, ad adopted or accepted or somebody learn how to use it, I think it'll be a good um, innovation. It's a change to the normal. And uh, I think uh, it'll um, give boost to the advancement of uh, music as a whole and with new ideas, especially these days that the inventions are uh, happening so fast and uh, just the, the sky is the limit and I'm sure that uh, if people give it a, a, a it's a challenge and give it a chance to uh, try it out and see if it works because uh, for me as a 71 year old and if I can play it surely the young professionals can do much much better work job than I do and they, they can pr produce a better sound and improve on it and uh, because there's room for uh, improvisation and improvement, uh, this peak is, is open for, it's not limited to the shape as it is. Uh, it can be improved upon uh, for the good of everybody else. Thank you very much.